according to Tanzania 2015 national energy policy availability affordability reliability and access to modern energy services are key ingredient towards social economic development current power generation capacity is approximately 1500 megawatt which is very low for a country of 59 million people the largest single potential generation project in Tanzania is hydro power project in Stiglas Gorge on Rufiji River, which will produce 2,100 megawatts. The government of Tanzania has been considering establishing this power station since 1960s. When fully developed, it will be the largest power station in East Africa, if not all Africa. The 134 meter act concrete dam is expected to create a reservoir lake 100 km in length measuring 1200 square kilometers with 34 billion cubic meters of water. In 1901, German engineer Stigler led the first expedition to what is now known as Stigler's Gorge to consider potential infrastructure. Stigler, when measuring the gorge, was charged by an elephant and fell into the ravine. It was named after him in his memory. Plans for a dam were developed during British rule of Tanganyika. Alexander Telford conducted the first systematic development survey of Rufiji in 1928-1929, with engineer C. Gilman carrying out further studies in 1938-1940. These studies preliminarily envision irrigation infrastructure with a small dam at Stiglas Gorge to reduce flooding and protect downstream irrigation infrastructure. This changed in 1950s when the Food and Agriculture Organization started studying Rufiji River infrastructure. This included a far larger dam wall of around 100 meters that aimed to transform the valley to an artificial environment, providing water for agriculture. The FAO report was published in 1961 and saw 200,000 acres of irrigation. Plans turned toward hydropower after Tanganyika independence in 1961. President Nyerere saw hydropower dam as key delivery for his ambition modernization program. From 1969 to 1974, second year five development plan this modernization plan increasingly aimed for industrialization and therefore needed cheap electricity. This understanding of dam as developmental and their ability to deliver cheap electricity drove the Great Ruaha hydropower project with involved hydro plant at Kidatu and Mtera. The Ruaha is an upstream tributary of Rufiji. When President Magufuli got in power in 2015, the dream of Stigler Gorge started again and this time it was serious the dam is now under construction and hoping to be finished in 2022 if this dam will be finished it will be the biggest in east africa and the biggest in africa i hope it will be finished and help the people of tanzania and their neighboring countries